Hi friends, I'm Papa Joe and welcome to a new Call of Duty mobile video on this channel. In this video we take a look at rumors, upcoming changes and leaks you should know about the next season 5 in Call of Duty mobile. Be sure to subscribe to me and activate the bell for daily COD mobile content. As always, let's jump right into the video. First, let's take a look at the latest community update which was posted on Reddit a few days ago and with an information about the new Season 5. Because a user had told the COD Mobile team that there are a lot of maps from older games that are iconic memorable and would fit well into the gameplay of this game, but they don't reappear for this game yet, and he thinks the older side of the community deserves some attention for once. Call of Duty Mobile responded with the following words, already hinting at a map in the new Season 5, hey. Uh. Love the enthusiasm for the classic COD titles. So we do have a map in the next couple of seasons that is from a game older than Black Ops 4 and that's the most you'll get out of me. So far there is no information which older map it could be but feel free to write me a map in the comments. After the release of the new season for Wild Dogs, Many hoped that the persistence perk would be nerfed due to the great dissatisfaction of the community. According to COD Mobile a small change to the persistence perk was planned for the current Season 4 and the really big change will happen in the upcoming Season 5. I think many of you will be happy about that because the team is apparently already working on it. Also, for the new Season 5, we can expect a big battle royale update with many changes as well as more big weapon balance changes in the game. While we don't know exactly what the battle royale update will look like, I can imagine that we might get a new vehicle after the rally car is released in the game for season 8 second anniversary. Also I can imagine that we will see a battle royale lucky draw in the new season and with that I lead directly to the next topic because so far there were some rumors and information about possible lucky draws and legendary skins that should appear in the new season 5. Because some weeks ago some legendary skins were found in the in-game files which will be released in season 3 and season 4. However, the legendary Cordite skin called Demo did not appear, so I assume that we will get more information about this weapon skin with the next test server update. Furthermore, there is a lucky draw in the Chinese version that has not yet appeared in Global Angarina and there is a tiny possibility that this interesting lucky draw will be included in Season 5. We are talking about the Harley Davidson lucky draw which includes an interesting Seraph character skin and the only legendary BY-15 skin in the game so far, as well as a very nice motorcycle skin. This is not confirmed information but still it is possible. Write me your opinion about this interesting draw in the comments section. Otherwise, there is a possibility that we will get a new mythic weapon skin in the game in the next season, but as I said, so far the test server update for season 5 and 6 is missing to say for which weapon a mythic skin will come, because the mythic AK-47 was so far the only weapon skin which was not introduced together with the default version. All the others were introduced season by season and appropriately designed a mythic skin. As always, I am very excited to see what the next mythic skin will look like because we will probably have a summer theme in the next season 5. Last but not least, I would like to announce that the new test server will be officially released next week and when it is, I will of course inform you about it in a separate video. And after I told you about the Godzilla King Kong collaboration in Call of Duty Vanguard and Warzone a few weeks ago, the brand new Godzilla Tracker Pack bundle was recently released in the store. Fittingly, a short trailer was uploaded to the official Call of Duty channel which I'm currently showing you and in my opinion, this skin looks extremely badass. 
What do you think about it and would you be happy about such a collaboration in COD Mobile or even in COD Wartson Mobile? Drop me your answers in the comments. And that's it for the video. I hope you liked it and enjoyed it. If so, give it a thumbs up and if you're new to my channel be sure to subscribe and activate the notification bell. Don't forget to check out my other videos on my channel. Thank you so much.